This is an introduction to my experiments with supercapacitors, specifically Cornell Dublier supercapacitors. My experiments will include measurements of device parameters as well as some interesting applications of supercapacitors. Here are the main topics. One is a supercapacitor magic meter. Two is a son of a sun thermometer. Three is a you've got mail alert system. Four is a remote doorbell called megahertz knock. And five is an early warning system. These systems haven't been designed yet, but here's a sneak peek at what they're all about. First up is a capacitance meter. I have some capacitance meters, but they can't measure capacitance in the supercapacitor range. This meter will use an Arduino Uno R4 because it has a 14-bit analog to digital converter. I call it a SuperCap Magic Meter. It will have a display to show capacitance, ESR, and voltage, etc. It's going to have several modes of operation, which will be selected from a rotary dial in the middle here. The six positions will be shown by LEDs around the outside here. And there will be a rotating knob in the middle. Down at the bottom will be two banana jacks for the probes. And that's about as far as I've got with the design so far. I have started laying out the card that goes in here as a shield for the Uno R4. And that gives me the dimensions for all the components. But the complete design will have to wait for a future installment. Next up will be a remote gate entry alarm system called the EnterGate system. And this is the gate it's going to monitor using a solar powered supercapacitor as its power source. This is a block diagram of the system at the gate. It will be a simple transmitter controlled by a reed relay and a magnet and powered by a supercapacitor and solar cell. A block diagram for the gate status system shows a simple receiver with control logic to control some status indicators. The next application is an indoor thermometer which is powered by light. A supercapacitor stores power from a solar cell, which is used to power the system while updating the temperature. The next application is a remote mailbox alert system. This is quite similar to the gate alarm, except that you'll have to reset the system once you've collected the mail. Next up is a wireless doorbell. It is also powered by a supercapacitor and solar cell combination. This one has a twist in that the indicator includes an audio annunciation. Finally, we have an early warning system. This one will use a millimeter wave radar to detect people coming up to the walkway so we know they're coming even before they press the doorbell. This system will also feature an audio announcer. I'm not sure yet if this receiver will be powered by a solar cell. And that's the last system in the plan so far. Now I get busy with design and wait for parts.